when it comes to Spider-Man. Here's my solution, and it's very simple. Unmask! <laughs> That's all of them. Let's find out what they were up to. Yuri, this sounds nuts, but I think this group of Sable agents is locking people up and straight up robbing them. You mean asset seizure? That's for drug dealers, mobsters. Yeah, well, they're applying it to anyone with nice cars or jewelry. Which just makes them criminals. Treat them like it. When you were little, did you say, I'm gonna grow up and be a fascist oppressor? Yeah, you probably did. More Sable guys. Good news? There is no good news. Spider-Man, that Sable unit's gone rogue before. Sable International's got their hands too full to do anything about it. But they don't care if we do. I was gonna take him down anyway. But this makes it more fun. Thanks. Great! More of them! 
Look, I may consider surrendering if you let me blare the siren on the way to lockup. won't stop. Tell Silver Sable I said I'm not interested, and this is really getting stalkerish. That was harder than it should have been. Captain, all the people in the cells are out, and they've got their property back. Good. And Sable International swears they're going to prosecute that squad. I'll believe it when I see it. Yuri. Looks like some people were protesting this Sable base, and the agents responded by locking them up. Great way to win hearts and minds. Can you get them out? It'll take some persuasion, but I'm a pretty persuasive guy. I know, I should have called first.
I just heard Sable issuing an internal bounty on you. Huge bonus for any agent that brings you down. Something like a little healthy competition to maintain a positive work environment.
Well, that was educational. That was terrifying. Thank you, Spider-Man. Got the people out of the cells. They don't seem inclined to continue their protest. I hate that Sable's violating constitutional rights, but right now, I'll settle for keeping innocent people out of lockup. Thanks. Moving in on Central Park, over. Yuri, I have eyes on a Sable base. They've got prisoners, but I don't know what they're charged with, and I don't want to let dangerous people back on the streets. The real criminals they turn over to us. The people they hold on site haven't done anything they can make a case over. I can think of at least two amendments that violates. Okay, looks like I'm staging a jailbreak. People around here work. What did you do? 
guys are persistent. What kind of pay you get? Asking for a friend. Spider-Man, I did some research. All the people they're holding data protest disabled heavy-handed tactics. Gotcha. I'm lodging a protest myself right now. I'll let you know how it goes. You do this for money, right? Well, how much to lay off? And don't say more than 20. All that drama, and for what? Captain, the area is secure and the cells are all empty. Officially, I can't condone that. Unofficially, thanks. Captain, these Sable guys look like they forced all the residents out of a building so they could occupy it themselves. And locked up the ones who objected. Okay, that I can get something done about. But I need victims to come forward. <laughs> I'll get the people out and have them file reports with the police.
like not to have anywhere to stay. It's a good thing these Sable agents have body armor, because I just might lose my temper.
think I lost him. That was harder than it should have been. That was terrifying. Thank you, Spider-Man. Captain, the people that were locked up are headed back to their homes. Good. And I finally convinced the mayor's office that making constituents homeless was not good for his poll numbers, so they won't be pulling that stunt again. Spider-Man, good news. The mayor finally cracked the whip on Sable International. No more locking up New Yorkers without due process of law. Guess they figured out it was a PR disaster. For once, we got a clean win. Well, not quite. I hear rank-and-file Sable agents blame you for stopping the gravy train. They'll be gunning for you even harder now, and no one's going to stop them. By now, I think it'd freak me out more if nobody was gunning for me. Let them come. I'll be ready.